हे हॅलो रॉन माय नेम इज रवींद्र अँड आय वेलकम यू टू माय यूट्यूब चॅनल इन दिस व्हिडिओ वी विल सी हाऊ टू हाईड अँड ॲप परमिशन पॉप अप इन द पॉवर ॲप्स ओके वेन यूवर यू ओपन द ॲप ओके दिस टाईप ऑफ ॲप परमिशन पॉप अप टू कन्फर्म द परमिशन टू डेटा ॲक्सेस विल शोकेस हिअर ओके सो वी विल बायपास दिस कंटेंट मीन्स दिस पॉप अप शूड नॉट डिस्प्ले ओके अँड यू ऑलवेज बी अलोड to this po connections okay so let's i showcase you how it look like okay so here i have app yaml code demo so let's i click on the play mode okay so my app is loading now okay you can see fetching data starting your app connecting to the data source okay now it is asking me the app permission to to play yaml code demo app okay refresh any connection ensure this share from trusted source and it is asking me to allow okay so let's so but uh, i don't want this pop up it should directly open the power apps okay so we can do that so for that purpose we need the power shell okay so let's i go to and open the power shell here okay so you can see i just open the power shell here okay so in the power shell you need to run the command okay first one install module name microsoft power app administration power shell scope current user and force okay so to before run any command and other thing okay i highly encourage you to go to this block okay i just write this block to help all of you okay here everything is mentioned okay to do this okay you must need the system administrator role okay and the app id for this so each step each command okay everything is mentioned also added a screenshot here okay so same we will follow this block okay let's i simply click on the enter here okay so i already sign in okay to my account but <clears throat> if you are doing first time so here you will get sign in option you just need to sign in to the app okay then we need to run this okay set admin power app bypass consent so let's i go copied that okay and let's i simply okay it is installing okay taking some time okay so it is install will sign in successfully as well okay then we need here you can see version 2.022 module microsoft is currently in use so let's i go and pass the id of my application here okay so from where you will get this app id okay so you just have to go to your power apps okay let's i hide this and open the power apps here let's i go to the power apps click on the details here okay they are asking app name so app name in this case this is the app name okay so let's i open power shell and simply provide this and click on the enter okay here it should be app okay now simply run this command okay so it is asking me for the environment name okay i will update this in the block as well from there you can copy so for the environment same i just go to the power apps okay in that just click on this gear icon click on the developer resources from here you need to copy this name okay and let's open the power shell just simply paste this name click on the enter here okay it is asking for sign in let's i sign in to my account
so here i have signed in successfully okay and it is just bypassing the content okay you can see we get 200 status now okay so i hope you can able to see let's i go to the this app and simply refresh one time okay we will not get that pop-up i hope so so let's see what output we are getting so it is getting data and we directly load to the power apps okay it not ask us for the data permission to allow and other thing okay you can see data is present now okay you can directly play you can save your time okay and if you want that okay so for that purpose also we have one command clear admin okay and here you need to provide the app id so let's say i provide the app id here okay i simply click on the enter so that pop-up will came return okay i just need to give environment name so i provide environment name data is okay if i refresh then that pop-up will return came that's all about friends in this video if you have any question any doubt in this video just ask me in the comment box okay and do subscribe to channel as well as mention your thoughts comments in this video okay and um, if you have any suggestion for my next video just please provide in the comment box also share your thoughts okay how you love this session or not and keep learning keep growing keep motivated thank you friends have a nice day to you bye